Hey everybody, it's Tamika. I'm here with the design team project for the Cutting Cafe. This week's design team challenge was to use either the suitcase box set, mini book, treat box, or the postcard. And I was so super excited to be able to play with my Heidi Swap Sugar Chic paper. I knew that when I got it, I was going to make a project for my daughter. She's 12 years old, preteen, and these are fantabulous colors for her. And um, the suitcase box set was the perfect menu for this paper. So let me show you what I created. It's so cute. <laughs> it's so pretty. I absolutely love how this box turned out. Just give you a little aerial view. It's just underneath. Look at that paper. Just gorgeous. So pretty. So, um... This box measures, it's a pretty size um, suitcase. It's about five and a half by nine. I'll put the links to all the files that we could use in the description box, as always, so you guys can check it out. But um, this is what I made. So pretty. So as you can see, I used the Sugar Chic paper. Um, I have some trim, this uh, trim, this turquoise trim, or lace rather, I got from a while ago this is what it looks like it's so very pretty and delicate and I actually got it from Webster pages designer trim and I've had this in my stash for a you know, long time at least I don't know two years it's been in there for a while so I end up using this um, piece of turquoise lace because it matched perfectly with the paper collection and um, that's that's what I'm using in lieu of the straps I do have the straps underneath but I just bordered it with the lace and then I have some black pearl string and then I use this gorgeous hot pink pleated trim that I got from Sean Lee who is Chantel here on YouTube hey lady we did the when we did the um, box what is that the gift card what was the packs guys <laughs> the swap that I hosted that had the lace and trim and stuff in it which I for some reason can't think of it but she had this in in her package so um, for me and it's very pretty very very pretty satin and organza pleated trim so thanks so much Chantel I was so happy to be able to use that and I just have some recollection bling you can see and then some flowers uh, from my stash that I, that I had collected and this is the uh, front I have a little handle and then it has this cute little luggage tag that I haven't put anything in there yet because I'm not sure what I'm going to label it but I am going to use some acetate and um, cover that up and then have a little label here there are some labels that go with it as well so yeah that's how it opens up there's under here is a little um, full you know where you put your suitcase in there if you can see under there you, I just attached it with brads and then it's just this little latch so some people use velcro some people use magnets so I just decided that fits it tucks right in there when I'm holding it at, the, at its correct position so that's the box so so pretty and this is what I made for Taylor this is going to be her box so she can open it so this is how it opens like that that's the top half and then on the inside I made her a little book and she can use this book or the idea that I have for her to use this book look at the inside of that it's just so pretty it's so pretty it's really deep really deep so um, the idea that I have for her for this book is to use it for her pictures for her recent um, hotel birthday party she wanted a hotel birthday sleepover and um, so that's what she got and um, a lot of her friends came over and spent the night and they have, did nails and they played in the pool and did all that stuff so she has all these pictures that she just has in a pile so this is an awesome way because they did the nails and they did the little dancing and all that kind of stuff this paper worked perfectly for that so I loved it so again I have some more of Chantel's lace down here or not lace but the pleated trim some more of the pearls some more of the flowers and bling and then here I just cut from the paper collection this is the banner and then on top of that I popped up friends it had best friends on it but I fussy cut them both out but friends was just the 
better choice for the way the paper was or the book is designed. And then there's some more, um, there's some more pearls. And then I got this ribbon from, um, the, oh, that was a gift set swap that I hosted that had this in there. But this recent swap was the bottle cap or the embellishment swap. And this came from, um, Tracy Johnson. Hi, Tracy. She gave us, um, this ribbon was holding on one of the bottle caps she gifted us. So I used this ribbon here for that. I used my bind it all. And then, da, 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 da. Tracy, there's your tea because her name is Taylor. So it was the perfect match. I could not have asked for a better embellishment. I love swapping and being able to use the embellishments that we swap. So here is her gorgeous handmade bottle cap. So I will tell Taylor definitely where this came from and that it was handmade and this book is made with love all the way around. So that's a little T and, you know, it's her initial too as well. So that worked perfectly. And then her little book is the suitcase, if you can see. Suitcase is like that. So I just have it in the upright position. A little charm hanging here. And then all I did was... Um, Use the leftover scraps that I had from making the card that I originally made with this paper for Danessa's daughter, Jayla. And then um, I just cut up the rest of the paper. I added some chip, um, lightweight chipboard. And these are 4 by 6 photo mats. So she's able to shrink down her photos just a little bit. And it'll fit right on here. And like I said, it's just like a mini smash book, I guess. But there we go. And um, that just tucks nicely. And then on the inside, because this is so deep, on the inside, she can also put um, some of the things, memorabilia she collected, like the coasters she collected from the hotel room and some other stuff that she collected that um, she's able to use for her uh, birthday memory box. So I absolutely love how this turned out. I love this file. Regina is awesome. She totally rocks. And... Um, I hope you guys like it as well, and please leave a comment. Let me know what you think, and check out the Cutting Cafe for this file, the mini book, the treat box, the postcard, and many, many other things. Also, be sure to check out Cyber Monday. She always has a sale on Mondays, and if you leave a comment on this week's blog post, you are entered to win three files. So thank you guys for watching. Have a good afternoon.